Hello everybody, welcome back, it's Friendly Grinder here with some more Diablo action. But before we start, please remember to subscribe to the channel and also don't hesitate to drop some useful comments with your thoughts about builds or maybe some new ideas. Hit that shit! Drop it! Hello guys one more time, so I do manage to finish 136 greater reef. What's the, the changes? As you can see already, area damage 118, a cooldown reduction uh, 42. So the major changes which I applied, I just rerolled the, uh, like I said before, I just rerolled the cooldown reduction to chance to deal 24% area damage on hits. I swap convention of elements. As you can see, I, I'm losing like 7% 7, 7 of the damage overall. So we're talking about 300,000 damage overall, but then um, I just test that and just like open my eyes. I was blind, but now I see. So, I mean, I knew we have to do that. Then I just realized like how fast you're just killing everything. Like when you have like proper area damage here. So this is much better. I was running like that. Basically, I had like 74, and then right now I'm running with uh, 118. I'm actually considering to apply more area damage. I was thinking about to swap this, but then I'm losing another almost 9% damage, so it's like not really good. We're talking about almost 400,000, but with that being changed here, it will be good for the trash mobs. I was blind, but now it's better. With that change, if I'm gonna swap this, I might struggle to kill the boss guardian on the end. For me, it won't be like really huge deal, but overall, I just for me, it was like. What I try to say, I still wanna found like the perfect ring. The world is changed. Like, I wish to have this one instead of strength to area damage, and then I will run it like that. I will have that buff of the da damage, you know. But I was testing like that, and just. I don't know. It's much better. We'll see. I mean, I'm just showing you guys what I've been running on this run, and then I might consider to test that a bit more. But like I said, I wish to have this perfect stats. Then I will be like more happy to run. <laughs> but other than that, like 118 area damage is. Oh boy, it's like really trash mobs. Like, <laughs> that's what we're talking about. You need that area damage. Other than that, that was my first convention of elements I've been running. Then I swapped to the pure damage. So as you can see, 7 percent more damage and then I realized like the area damage is like the thing so I mean I know everybody running but I was trying to run my own builds until I'm hitting the wall or until I really have to you know use that rent manually but it's like not really other way around you have to apply the rent manually and actually the more area damage you have it's you, you will be better off so as I said before and I'm just gonna remind you guys one more time on the shoulders it's like really good to have the area damage instead of the resistance to all elements even if you will have like critical hit damage here critical hit chance you might consider to reroll the cooldown reduction here to area damage as well so like two pieces to to get another 40% area damage which will be like 150-ish so that's like really huge buff it's really huge buff it's like all attacks have a 20% chance to also deal the ammo of you have the area damage of the damage to enemies within 10 yards so it's like fuck oh my god it's crazy but you have to you know remember one fact is if like if you swapping the pure damage like you trying to put as much area damage as you can and you basically decreasing your overall damage you have to understand like you will be struggling a bit to kill the uh, Reef Guardian but that shouldn't be really like a big deal because at the end of the day the most important part is to hit the stacks right we have to leverage the uh, seasonal buff to basically finish off those high higher greater rifts like angels and stuff like fireworks like 400 fireworks 500 angels right so we need to actually try to reset like two times or maybe even three times the stacks to killing trash mobs you always better when you try to get area damage so i might even swap that on the next run i don't know we'll see i mean right now it's like running really good so i'm just gonna keep it this way but other than that i'm not going to reroll that i'm just gonna keep it like it is one major upgrade i wish to do like i said so the bind of mind this is like it's, it's great but it's not like perfect it's like we have the critical hit chance increase but we don't have the critical hit damage increase so but i have the area damage. i will test that because overall we might you know killing faster trash mobs and that's basically what we need to do like killing the trash mobs faster 137 and then i can add two slots here or even three slots if we're gonna remove the cooldown reduction from the amulet so we're talking about 60 percent more so it's almost like 200 more damage so the guys this is like the trash mobs that will like melt it best day of my life
But, well, that's on the perfect world in the perfect universe. And I don't have those items. I'm not really, you know, speed farming and farming items anymore. I'm just trying to push the great area. So, yeah. So I think I cover everything. I hope you guys like it. Enjoy the clip. Uh, see you next one. Hit that shit.
Just walk right out the door Don't wanna do this anymore Now I'm lost without you You drive me crazy out my mind How'd you do this every time? Now I'm lost without you You still be the one I talk to when I'm sad can you see now tainted love is all we have? I wish it run so deep now when I try to sleep I feel so bad I should leave and by the time it's done I'll be
Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out We got this far, don't know how Just like a spark that's breaking out Can't make a stop 